Super Tuesday coming at you. Not live this week, but we got a whole bunch of stuff to talk about. It's going to be a lot of fun. Shorter day today. Getting right into it. Happy birthday, Superman. And to celebrate, super upcoming director of Superman Legacy, writer director of Superman Legacy, showed off this little picture right here, written by James Gunn, Superman Legacy. That is his script. And when asked if it was the whole script or just a page, which was... Uh, spoken uh, in jest, James Gunn replied, the whole script. And then he was asked if he'll be announcing who will be playing Superman this month, if not next month, and he said, we will not find out who is playing the Man of Steel until well into the summer or beginning of the summer. Look, at some point after spring, we're going to find out who's playing Superman. As the rumors are running rampant, James Gunn did say, do not believe any of the nonsense you see online. Only believe what he or Warner Brothers states. And so far, that's been accurate with his casting of Creature Commandos. Ron Perlman, who? Anyway, James Gunn trusts the source, and he is open about everything. And if he had someone cast, he'd be like, well, shut up. I'm not telling you today. Moving right on, the Russos, do they want to direct Batman? Let's get right into it with an interview at comicbook.com. The Russo brothers have indicated that they may or may not be interested in directing Batman the Brave and the Bold. Anthony Russo began uh, the question by saying that they don't really get asked about DC characters often, then went on to say, obviously James over there running it, it would be a no-brainer, Joe continued. We love him to death. We love the direction he's going to take the world in. You know he's going to be inventive with it. And our favorite DC characters? I mean, man, there are so many good ones. I always answer based on the comics I collected as a kid and the two comics I collected the most, Spider-Man, actually the three, were Spider-Man, X-Men, and Batman. But there have been a lot of iterations of Batman, so I feel like that's an obvious answer but you know it's hard to answer that here's how you know we haven't actually gotten literal about it and specific about it because yeah batman would be my favorite character for my entire childhood but obviously it's been well explored so it sounds like if the opportunity presented itself they would definitely talk about it whether or not they would go down the rabbit hole of batman remains to be seen we have the robert pattinson batman out there obviously all the uh, you know from tim burton to joel schumacher in the 90s and then of course the classic now classic christopher nolan trilogy Dark Knight trilogy. So there's a lot, a lot to live up to with Batman as well. They did a spectacular job, I thought, with uh, Winter Soldier. And then, of course, uh, Infinity War and Endgame were brilliant. And James Gunn wrote the dialogue for the Guardians of the Galaxy characters within those movies. So they have a great working relationship with James Gunn. If James Gunn reached out to them, I'm sure they talk whether or not they would take it. Remains to be seen. Would you guys be interested in seeing the Russo brothers take on a new Batman film? Batman Brave and the Bold. Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. Give us a like and a subscribe. And until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.